Gang, hey, welcome back to the channel, y'all. As always, make sure y'all hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. Get this video a like as well. And in today's video, hey, we at Annapolis Mall right now, so I'm gonna check out some of the shoes they got sitting, man. And I might do my $200 shopping challenge, man. But yeah, we at the mall, JD right here, man. So we're gonna hit this JD up real quick and see what they got. But first, pulling up, of course. Got the um the little kids black toes. We got pandas sitting as well, y'all. So yeah, that's that as far as right now. Some cool Adidas right here, though. These nice, they definitely they got some type of grip grip things at the bottom, man. But some Adidas right here in JD. Um What else we got? What else we got? So we got some Nike dunks right here. Some more uh, dunks right there as well. Got the Langley Ron still in here. Some other dunks. Some Jordan 1 Lowe's. These joints look pointy as hell. Them look like some dress shoe joints, man. They still got the snakeskin Jordan 11 Lowe's. They got them vibes that came out. The more reflector joints. Moving down, moving down. Got some nice 90s, 60s right here, man. Just to make a nice back to school shoe. Got the navy blue for 110. That ain't bad for those right there. Got some more Nike dunks. Some more dunks right there as well, y'all. So that was the women's and kids uh, section. So we're going we to slide on over here to the men's section of things. So right here in the men's section, we do have... The JD exclusive uh, um, Barclays right here. They would have been better if they didn't have like this black type of shadow to it. But if they wouldn't have did that, it would have looked like them orange joints that came out like in 2020, I think. Or maybe last year. Maybe last year. But yeah, you got your Cyber Jordans right here. Right here we have the Palomino, excuse me, the Palomino 3s. We still got the uh, Chambray 7s right here. Elephant print Jordan ones. We got the UNC tote Jordan one lows right here. I might pick these up. Only reason why I have them because I got the highs, but they got the mids right here too. Some red toes, some red toe lows, and they got these Jordan one mid. These the uh, Palominos. These some Palomino ones right here, y'all. Look, so we got the Palomino ones. These ain't bad, bro. These are not bad, bro. Jordan brand crazy, man. They didn't give us the Palomino 3 and then throw a Palomino 1 in there. Still not bad, though. I think that's a mid, though. They should have made these in a hot top form. That's a mid, but it still ain't a bad shoe. Got some dunks right here, too, y'all, as well. Like a gradient color going on. You know, fading into the blue right there. Got some black ones as well. I don't know. These are super pandas. These dunks got suede and everything, man. Nice little Nike swoosh. Yeah, these ain't bad, man. I would wear these. I wouldn't wear these right here, but I'll wear those right there. Those are cool. All right, y'all, so walking in the downtown locker room, off the rip, we got the UNC2 Chicago Lowe's right here. This is a small size right here. This joint, almost, this joint ain't bigger than your boy hand. But yeah, we got these in the women's section. Langley's just like every other store, man. They must have did a restock on those. Cause I wasn't seeing them a lot like I'm seeing them now, but really nothing right here. But right here, we got the uh, Wolf Gray 13s in every size. We got toddler, preschool, grade school, and we got men in these joints. Uh, it's not a bad shoe, but I just, I can't get with all the white on the 13th, but it's just too much white. It make the shoe look bulky. It's already a bulky shoe, but yeah, just not for me. It's not a bad shoe, though. Not a bad shoe. Will they last long? I don't think so, man. Unless you take care of your shoes, they're going to start yellow and the laces is going to look yellow. I don't know, man. We didn't need these. Jordan Brand didn't have to give us these. They could have gave us a different pair of 13. But these going to sit, man. Y'all see them next summer, too. They also have some black toe loads sitting in that downtown lock room as well. These ain't going to sit long, though, man. Like I told y'all, these ain't going to sit long. School about to start. Perfect little school shoe. These going to go, bro. Just going to take some little time. They going to go, though. All right, y'all, so we right here at MD Sneaks. MD Sneaks in the building, man, you know what I mean? 
They located in uh, Annapolis Mall, y'all. All right, y'all, so real quick, we're gonna check out they, uh, they grill cabinet. So right here, we got some black phantoms. We got the olives. We got the fragment highs, fragment lows, reverse mochas, mocha highs, Travis Scott, uh, Air Force Ones, off-white blazers, off-white UNC Jordan 1, uh, some lot dunks right here, some SBs, uh, lobsters right there. We got some Kobe's at the bottom. More Travis Scott. This a little heat cabinet, man. This thing hot. Ah, this thing. Ah, this thing hot, man. This damn cabinet hot, y'all. Y'all tripping. We got the snake skin drawing fours right here, y'all. What y'all think of these? I never seen these before. This is my first time. Yeah, so that one was technically like a, a GR, but I think it was limited to like uh like ten thousand pairs or something like that. So yeah. it was definitely like a more limited release. And the retail on that was like four hundred, I believe, when it came out. Thirteen hundred, that ain't bad, but it's not a style for everybody. You gotta know how to rock those. Man, what y'all think your boys should y'all think your boys should do lots for his birthday? Off white lot dunks? That was a really good pack of off whites. Six hundred? Which lot is this, man? Right. Lot fifteen? Yeah. What y'all think? I I would dog these, man. Make these look nice. We got the we got the royal blue. I think that's blue. Or purple. That's blue. That's blue. The laces? Yeah. I would say, yeah, it's like purple. purple. Okay, like, yeah, so we got the purple with the pink hang tag, with the pink tongue. I don't have no, I don't have no lots neither, y'all. We're going to look on the shelf, man. We're going to keep this out, though, man. I might got to get that 600. That ain't bad. I'm, uh, we got some, uh, we got some ice blue, 10 and a half. Jordan 10 is right here. It they ain't had so much white, but majority of the 10s is white, so look at them black cements about to fall apart, man. He touched that joint, it's probably gonna crumble. And what's those? Uh, Concords? Some yeah. Concords right there as well. What is that? A cool, what kind of 10 is that? Oh, so that's a, uh, like a, it's not like an actual shoe, it's like a, um, a mold of yeah, a shoe? Yeah, so it's like, it's just like a little, like, okay, we got joint. the Jordan 10 moldables. We gonna call these the moldable ten. Damn, that, that thing heavy, yeah. man. That's a uh, center block. Be putting it near the glass. So that's a see. center block, man. That's oh, a nice. Yeah. That's nice. Whoever did that, that was nice. Dang, nah, these on fire. I should have got these when I got my white ones, man. These I gave my white ones away to um to my boy Jeremy Acid, man. I gave him the white joint. These fire right here, Jesus. A little vault yellow. What's that? Yellow or green? That's green. All right, they also got the split dunk still sitting. They got some other dunks right there as well. And they got these dunks that I showed y'all in the other store with the suede. These clean right here, it's a clean pair of dunks. What am I, I should grab these splits and use my points and get these junk for $100, man. That wouldn't be bad. All right, y'all, so for the kids side, they still got the 13 Wolf Grays. They also got the Black Flints, the Playoff 13s. Crab Fives, Toro Sixes, Palomino Threes, Wash Blacks, uh, The Miz, Black Toe Lows, UNC Miz, uh, Black Toe Miz, the little golden joints. They got a they got a lot of kicks in the kids section, man. I wish my feet was that small. Alright, y'all. So y'all know we was right here at uh Columbia Mall, right? So we walked up in the JD checking out the sneaks. So they was about to close, man. We end up buying whatever we was going to buy, right? But we stuck in the junk now. Right? We stuck in the junk. Whoever the employee was that had the daggone key to the gate, he done rolled out. Now we stuck down here in the food court, man. I'm about to, I'm about to send out an SOS. What, what we supposed to do? You know what I mean? I need to get in contact with corporate. But yeah, y'all, we stuck in the JD, man. What y'all got in the back that's unreleased? Okay. We stuck in this jump. What, what, what was in the back? Bring up, bring up real quick. What, the Palominos? Bro, them better not be the Alainos, boy. Yeah, buy a pair, them bitches. Man, we stuck in the JD. Y'all owe me something, man. We stuck in this bitch. Yeah, I did too. She behind me, son. No, come out and set Those are the problem, you know. She done locked us in here. Damn, y'all, we got the Palomine Hayes right here. Nah, I'm 12. Man, my birthday Friday, too? 
<laughs> man, for real, man. Let me buy a pair of these, bro. We got the Palominos right here. Ooh, these uh, don't smell. Man. Oh, man. man, that's crazy. <laughs> this would've been perfect for your boy, man. This would've been perfect for my B-Day. Yeah, we got the Palominos up in here, man. Man, what the hell is up? We stalkery, man. Oh, there you go. We finally getting released. That's a female. Oh, I'm so sorry. Man. She did that motherfucker, man. I'm sorry. You owe us some shoes for that. You owe us. I owe y'all some shoes. Yeah, I got y'all. Next time y'all come in, nah, the Palomino 12s, yeah, we need a The Palomino 1s. Right. The ones. The ones? The yeah. ones that's about to come out. Okay. Yeah, for my, right. birth my birthday Friday, man. Oh, happy early birthday. Yes, thank I you, will. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right, Crow Gang. So, we made it back to the crib, you guys. Hope y'all enjoyed the small little vlog. A lot of the stores did have some of the same stuff. Nothing real special was going on. A lot of the same shoes sitting or whatever the case may be. The resale store, they had some cool little stuff too, but nothing spectacular. I didn't grab the uh, the off-white locks. Not yet, not yet. I'm still thinking about going back for those for a B-Day shoe, but what I'm planning on doing is taking a couple pair of these shoes that, you know, I don't wear. Probably go trade them in and, you know, put the difference to it. I might, I might. It depends how many pairs I can come up with. If it's not a lot, then I'm not even gonna do it. But anyway, for this half of the video right here in the nest, we got an unboxing of a shoe that I meant to kind of pretty, I, I say kind of pretty. I kind of meant to bend, bring y'all this shoe and this unboxing. I ain't gonna hold y'all up. We gonna get straight to it. I don't want the video to be too lengthy, baby. So let's get to it. Hit that subscribe button and get this video a like, man, for this unboxing we got right here. Boom, so starting with the box, we do have a nice box right here. One of them boxes that I would keep. I don't really keep my boxes, but this is a good box. It got social status going across the front and on the side. You got a lot of different designs going throughout the box. You got the Nike branding on the front right there as well. And the box label reads Nike Attack SP. The colorway is Summit White light iron ore so that's the colorway for these right here flipping open the box lid man you do get some special um shoe box paper right there so we definitely this is definitely one of the boxes that uh a person should keep i get rid of my boxes but you know what i mean speaking of getting rid of a box we get ready to get rid of this box and now <laughs> The box is adios, baby. Now for the kicks. Let's get these kicks in hand, baby. Woo. That was easy, y'all. That was easy. But yeah, right here, we got the Nike Air Mac Attack Social Status joints right here. So this is the Social Status collab with the Nike Air Mac Attack. So... Like I said, I've been I've been meaning to bring Ben, bruh, bruh tongue tied. But yeah, I've been meaning to I've been meaning to bring y'all this reviewing, man. But we getting it out the way now. But like I said, we got the social status Mac attacks joints right here that released like last month sometime. Clean shoe, clean shoe. And if you didn't know. The uh, the material actually tears away or you can cut it away. I believe it's from everywhere where you see like this. I don't know. This kind of it's kind of giving like satin vibes, but you can cut this right here. You can also cut the Nike sign, and you can cut up here as well, and it reveals something different. But these are nice. These are definitely nice. Hey. This is one of the better Mac attacks in my opinion. I like these and that red and white pair that they came out with. But as far as details, you do get a spare pair of laces that come in like this little uh, candy box right here. It says laces. And the color of the laces are... Uh, what color laces do they come with? Okay, then that's a nice color, man. That wouldn't be a bad lace swap right there. So they come with like some yellowish laces right here. Hey, I would have threw them. I would have threw them in there ASAP. But 
this is this is some dope special packaging. I feel like this is what we should get whenever they say SP. Whenever they say special packaging, everything should be different like how it is. And the inside of the shoe, you do get shoe box. I mean, uh, shoe paper. You do get shoe paper. I don't really want to pull that off, but you do get shoe paper. Special little box of laces, like I said, some little yellow colored laces. And it's also some other stuff inside the box as well. So hold on, we got some other little details to get to. So on this shoe right here, on the tongue of this shoe, you got that social status stamp right there on the tongue of this shoe. And on the tongue of this one, of course, you have your Nike Air branding on the tongue of this shoe. The bottoms, the bottoms are pretty simple pretty simple got the bottoms right there but it looked like these these gonna grip very well man I, hey they look like they gonna hold up they ain't gonna wear all fast they got stars going around throughout the whole bottom of the shoe they usually just be on the front but on these it goes all the way around to the back and it wraps around the whole shoe so as you can see at the bottom or the midsole right here you got like a cell color the Nike sign, I'm guessing that's that light iron ore right there. And I, I, I forgot the other color, man. What, what was the other color that they said these was, man? Let me reread. Okay, Summit White, which is pretty much sale. So you got the sale and you got the light iron ore with some, uh, like some gray laces, like some neutral gray laces or something. But like I said, clean shoe, clean shoe. But what I did want to get into is some of the extra things that come inside the box. So we're going to sit these to the side and get into some of this other box content. So looking through the paper, you do get, oh, they come with two pair of laces. Okay, okay. So there's another pair of spare laces inside the box as well. That's dope, man. That's dope. I tried to hit on these. I actually put in a raffle on these. These are actually not my size but i try to put on a raffle for these and you get like some some pink colored laces as well so you get yellow and like this little pinkish color right here for laces too that's clean hey i i ain't gonna lie i'll probably do one yellow and one pink or just mix them both in that's not bad and i definitely like the packaging of these uh uh these specific shoes right here man these are not a bad pair of mac attacks but yeah you got the extra pair of laces it also comes with this little thingy majiggy right here so i'm guessing okay so this is a bag is this a bag yeah 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 so it comes with a social status and nike bag right here so you got some type of some type of little bag. I can't even get it, y'all. Hold on. Give me that. Yeah, so you get this joint. It's the material is like very slippery. So I don't know what you call that slippery material, but yeah, you got the social status and Nike. Uh I can't even hold the bag up, y'all. You get the social status and Nike bag right here. And at the bottom it says the bottom of the bag reads. Thank you for supporting your neighbor. Thank you for supporting your neighborhood. That's what the bottom of the bag reads. Thank you for supporting your neighborhood. So this comes in the box as well. So social status, they they always, they always, they always bring it, bro. They always bring it every time they do a collab. I haven't really, I don't have no social status collabs, but all the ones that I have seen they did not drop the ball. They do good when it comes to collabs. This is, like I said, this is a great example of special packaging because a lot of the times it'll say special packaging and it won't be nothing too special. Like a lot of the, the Jordan brand shoes would say SP, which means special packaging, and we don't get no special packaging. But anyway, that's gonna do it for today's video, you guys. I love you guys. I hope y'all enjoyed the vlog. I hope y'all enjoyed the unboxing as well. 
hit that subscribe button on your way out. Give this video a like. Like I said, we just reached 7K subscribers, man. We just reached 7K subscribers. Don't forget to get into the Lost and Found giveaway as well. That's ending sometime this month. Get your entries up. Y'all already know how it goes. But anyway, I love you guys. I appreciate y'all. Hope you love them once. Let them know you love them. And always remain solid, baby. We are with the air, Nike, Mac Attack, baby. Okay.